My name is Judd. My name is Rich. And this is a comic strip AP of Burning Wheel featuring the saga of Lothian Wester. And when we last saw Lothian, he had a packed game last game. We did. He was on trial among the Society of Maggie for casting of spells in, Grey, in the free city of Greyhawk. The charges were dismissed, but we got to see kind of how the society works a little bit. And we met Kieran, who is the head of the Society of Maggie. And we also met Tande, the Gloam Walker, who is a master wizard who has, has the same tattoo that the wizard who assaulted uh, through the fireball and uh, stabbed Lothian in the first couple of sessions. That's right. We found out that that tattoo, uh, a sign that you've walked in the gloam, which is kind of like a faraway shadow realm. That, wow, there's more. How much did we cram into this 15 minutes? And then you talked to Jalarzi and you decided that you were going to go find Mordekainen, the archmage, together. Yes, yes, indeed. That was the first person you were going to find. To start at the top, as she said. Yeah, start at the top. Don't mess around. So you wanted to go talk to Tande, yes? Yes. We were to meet at twilight. Fantastic. Tande's apprentice comes to get you. Tande's apprentice is named Mavis. And Mavis is a, a young boy, maybe 10 years old, with a big sphere of brown hair all around his head. Very curly. And he very respectfully guides you to uh, Tande's humble tower. And Tande has a little tower in the city near the wall. Out back is kind of like a sand garden. And as soon as Mavis gets there, Tande hands him a rake and Mavis starts smoothing the sand out. And Tande says, let us sit and have tea and we will discuss what you want from the gloam. Very well. I am curious. Why is it that you have Mavis raking the sand? Ah, you you do not know the art of summoning. No, I am only passingly familiar with the concept. Well, this is where I shall draw the circle. If we wish to make symbols more complicated than sand will allow, we can put in slate and draw in chalk upon that. I see. But first we should discuss what you want of the gloam. Do you have, do you have more questions? Please ask, War Wizard. It is a shadow realm. What should... I be wary of when we enter the place. Well, I did not think we would be going there today. I thought I would be bringing a gloamer here to see you. A shadow, if you would. Ah, I see. That sounds wise. I wish to learn more about the man who attacked Jalazi, the man who I fought. Hmm. What is his name? Where can I find him? The shadows do not usually offer information unless we go up the rung very high. However, the dead are good with that kind of thing. And the dead do often walk in the gloam. I could call upon the restless dead who walk in the shadow realms. I see. They could perhaps tell you more about your friend. But as with all summoning, there is a price. Of course. It is magic. They will ask for a service. What are the bounds of this service that they will request? With the dead, they'll usually want some kind of tribute. Maybe a marker, maybe a statue, maybe a, a shrine to some lost god of theirs. Something physical and permanent here in the living world. Indeed. I see. I have no further questions. We will need to find this shade. All right. He begins, and you realize that the symbols that he's using, like, you're familiar with this stuff. You, you know symbology, and you could actually help him. Do you want to help him? I'd love to help him. Cool. Absolutely. If we were sitting at the table, you could hand me a die, and it would be very satisfying. But because we don't, you can't. And it takes a long time. Summoning through this system isn't something you do in the heat of combat. It's definitely something you take your time, you stop, and you go for a while. It takes the better part of an hour to get the circle just right, to get the symbols just right. And Tande also takes time to teach He's teaching Mavis the art of summoning, but he also like extends that lesson to you. So if you want, you can consider this a test towards opening summoning. I like that. Awesome. And then the lesson is over, and he calls forth a spirit of the dead. 
It seems to be someone he knows, someone who went with him to the Gloam, who didn't make it back. Is the the shade recognizable? Do they appear young? Could this have been a former apprentice of his? Or mm. oh, I like I that tell? idea, Rich. Yeah, I think, let's say that he and Mavis have very similar robes on. Mm. And when Tande went to the Gloam, yeah, he brought an apprentice with him and he didn't make it back. That's nice. That's a nice touch. Burning Wheel doesn't usually have that kind of hippie shared narration stuff, but it's such a good idea, I'm going to steal it. <laughs> the way the apprentice talk is kind of like this low wheeze. It says, Master, I'm not your master anymore. You call upon me again? He nods. I need a name. Someone who came into the gloam after me. Someone with hate in their heart. Someone who would bind a soul to their dagger out of spite, who also has the gloam marking upon their face. I know such a wizard. In the realms of things, they are nearby in the city. But what can you offer me, master? I think not much. I think nothing at all. Yes, I know. But this is not for me. This is for my friend. Yes, Shade, I am Losin Wester, a war wizard. I will pay the price for your information. Mm. What is it that you need? When I fell in the gloam, my staff was lost. I would ask that you find it. You walk into the gloam yourself once you have given justice to this wizard. And you find the staff and give it to my sister. Will you do that for me? I will do that for you. So I swear it. His name is Oruda of Iron Gate. That is his name? Yes, that is his name. Where can I find Oruda of Iron Gate? Where in the city? Oruda is in an inn called the Green Dragon Inn. Green Dragon Inn, very well. I look to Tande. What was your apprentice called in life? His name was Arkeem. Arkeem, thank you for your information. I will deal with Oruda, and very, very soon I will learn to travel to the Gloam and find your staff. Take it to your sister. Nods. Tande says, Arkeem. I, I'm... But before you can finish that sentence, the ghost is gone. Oh, ouch. Soundscape music was found on tabletopaudio.com. If you want awesome music for your game sessions, try tabletopaudio.com. Hi, this is Jason from The Gauntlet. If you enjoyed this episode of Comic Strip AP, be sure to check out our YouTube channel. We have many other Comic Strip AP shows available, each organized in their own sequential playlist for easy listening. Just go to youtube.com and search for Gauntlet RPG.